skip reminds me of the Word of God. <laughs> it says, so, you know, just kind of get in and uh, be up to your ankles, then up to your knees, and then by the time it gets over your head, saints, I think you're feeling a little bit overwhelming like you're drowning, but yeah, this is just the front porch off the steps, and there's so much water. It's so much. The little chihuahua is up to his ankles for sure. Uh, depending on where I'm at in the yard, I have to wear rubber boots because I'm up to my ankles. I'd much rather be up to my neck in holy water than rainwater. But you know what, saints, if you think about it, and if you really, truly think about it, if you dive into the Holy Spirit and you dive into that living water, it's a lot different than being overwhelmed by floodwaters. But you know what? There's so many saints today. The water will be running like a river and just flowing. And they will not get in the river. They're afraid. It's like, folks, the water is the washing of the Word, the Holy Spirit. Living water. It's not like physical water, saints. It's living water. It's holy. It's righteous. I'd be like, Lord, I don't want to be like this ground that's just saturated and it can't absorb any more water. I don't want to be a mud pit. I want that living water to continuously flow in and out, in and out. You know, the Word of God says, out of their bellies shall flow rivers of living water. It won't be stagnant, saints. It will continually be running and flowing. So ask the Lord today, not only to saturate you, but to allow you to absorb the living water so that it will come into you, it will be a part of who you are, and it will literally flow like rivers of living water. Hallelujah, 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 Lord, we love you. Love him today, saints. Ask him to let that water wash over you. Absorb into you. Saturate you with the living water. That the Holy Spirit would be in you in such a well. That he would bubble up out of you and he would flow out of you. Saints, I declare and decree that the living water is flowing out of you like living water true life out of your belly shall flow rivers of living water in the name of Yeshua Hamashiach who has Jesus Messiah I declare that the fire of the Holy Spirit would just consume anything and everything that is not of the Lord God Almighty and that quenching of the enemy's plot and plan and ploy it would come from the rivers of living water the quenching of the enemy's plots and plans and ploys against you that the river of living water would quench all of the fiery evil mechanisms of the enemy and that only holy fire would remain to purify you and cleanse you and that washing of the water of the word of god would not overwhelm you saints but that you would be completely and totally ready 
to dive in. Let the fire fall, Lord. Let the rain fall, Lord. Anything that you want to use, Father God, to completely purge us and cleanse us. Let it rain. Yes. Let it rain. Woo! Come on, Tom. Poor little fella. He says, Mom, I understand, but... Your ankles are a whole lot taller than mine are. You can do it, Tom. There you go. Good boy. And that's it, saints. Sister with a testimony. Hi, Tom. God bless you. I plead and apply the blood of Jesus over you to hide, protect, and keep you. And I'm praying out of your bellies shall flow rivers of living water. No more stagnation, saints. God bless you. I love you.